Good afternoon folks and welcome back to my home cafe. After the un unboxing video we did with the Nespresso Next uh, Virtual Machine and the Carafe Set, I'm going to go through now and make a carafe of coffee and pour a couple of, um, couple of drinks. So what we do is, first things first, turn the machine on. We've got a few seconds to warm up. And I'll get the carafe ready taking the top off and pop it up underneath underneath the spout and that should brew straight into that and then I'll turn on the clear just a pro because we're going to have some some hot milk in the carafe as well so that's come up with the jug single ready to steam the coffee okay so it looks like the machine's ready to go Lock it. And there's the, the pod, specially designed for the volume that's under carafe. It's a nice deep pod, which is different to the largest they make. So I'll pop that in and close the lid. You can hear the crack as it pierces the cup, the, the pod. So touch the button. It starts it's reading the reading the code. And while that's going on, I'll get some milk on the way because we're going to use a bit of milk to make up a coffee. To make a um make a carafe full of white white coffee. So I'll get the milk underway and it's starting to steam that but could take a few minutes to to fill the carafe so it may it may pour it for a bit maybe not the beauty of the virtual range of machines is they use the, the pods that have got a barcode system on them so when you put the pod in the machine it will automatically detect the volume of coffee required um, to suit the pot. Um, there are various sizes, being espresso for 40 mil, and Grand Lungo, which is usually 150 mil, and then you go to your mug size, which is usually about 400 to 440 mil. Uh, this being a 530 mil pot, so it's specially um, crafted and brewed um, to suit the, the carafe. First time we've first time we've used it. So I brewed the I brewed the milk a bit earlier than the than the coffee. So it's always best to have your coffee fresh um, after you this It's best to keep the coffee fresh, freshly poured. So. Cleaning itself with the Purchase to Pro, which is a very good feature. Okay, okay. the sand a bit is just starting to finish up. Oh, yep, fluid stopped running. There we go, we're all finished. So the carafe is full. Now, just a matter of unlocking it as soon as you open the lid up, it will eject the pod. Oh, there you go. Close that again and lock it. Now we've got the got our milk organised. So that's probably I say it's five five thirty mils. So I've probably got a little bit of milk. I'm not going to put a great deal of milk with it. It's just enough to lighten it up a bit to make a nice nice strong coffee. Now there's no sugar in the or anything like that. It actually comes with a silicon based spoon which doesn't defer the flavour of the coffee or hurt the um, double wall glassing. I'll just give that a stir through. It seems to have still kept its crema. Now let's see what we get in the way of 
I know I've already I've got two two double wall cups there which would probably hold maybe 200 to 250 mil each pour that through there we go that's one that's two so it looks like I'm going to actually get probably three three out of that so with the milk it's probably coming at maybe 600 maybe 700 mil of fluid altogether so I might just top that one up a little more and this is a crafted brew um, I didn't notice any intensity on the box or anything like that um, no but they say they're saying it's quite a, a delicate brew so I will give um, So we'll give this a bit of a stir and then we'll see what it tastes like. And a little bit because it's a bit of a, a carafe, it hasn't actually, by the time you've put the milk into the, the carafe, it's done away with a bit of the carima, but let's see how we go. Well, it's definitely kept its heat. I've only got one sugar in the cup. It's still sweet and mild. Mm, very nice drop, very nice drop. So there's enough there for two. Probably a bit more than than two cups, I'd say you could, if you're entertaining, entertaining friends, it would be more than enough to have two or three people over and make up two or three coffees at once. Yeah, so, so if you, it uh, does appear to be a little on the, a little on the strong side, so if you do like um, a milkier, milder um, coffee. Uh, there was still room in the carafe to add a little bit more milk. Um, so I've still got some, some milk in the jug there, which I can use. I could probably even prop that up a little bit more, which again has taken some, probably taken some of the uh, full bodied, full strength out of it, which has made it um, not as strong. We'll have a taste, have a taste in that. Just see if we can pick up on the difference, which I dare say we probably will. Yeah, it's made it a little bit more milder. So if you're not one for a very strong, um, strong brew of coffee, it's very nice indeed. Uh, the, this is what inspired me with this is uh, I had the, the virtual machine beforehand. Um, but uh, seeing the, the carafe set, and for those that like to have the more than one or two coffees in the morning, but you don't feel like brewing using two pods or um, having to brew two cups, this is ideal for brewing enough for either two or three cups for yourself or if you're entertaining friends. Um, so we brought the machine uh, and we brought the carafe set, um, and for those of us um, who are Nespresso lovers and you've ordered the machine this will give you a, an insight as to what can be done with the machine how many cups you'll get out of it um, the unfortunate thing is when you buy your pods they only come with eight in the sleeve um, and they're probably just short of uh, about nine to ten dollars um, per per sleeve so it still works out works out a little bit more pricey than what you would with a, um, a standard pod but again as I say you're getting three cups uh, out of out of one pod so okay so this is um hope this has helped a few people um, so thank you for watching and if you like what you'll see please subscribe to my channel um, or leave a like on uh, on the video thank you for watching